The Spain leg of the World Rugby Sevens series moves to Seville this weekend as the Blitzbox are preparing for the fourth tournament of the 2022 World Series. The Valhuman is looking to apply the same principles that brought glory in Malacca last weekend. The playmaker who has scored 169 points in 56 matches is comfortable in his current role. There's a lot of competition in, in, in my position, but yeah, no, we call it in the system, half the competition. Uh, it pushes us uh, to, to be better uh, every day. And, and yeah, we help each other. It's not about uh, your position, it's about how you contribute to the team and to the system. And I think uh, that's what makes our team uh, successful over the years. The 26-year-old human who captained the blitz box twice in the past, including the Canada Sevens tournament victory in Vancouver in 2021, is concerned about injuries. It's very tough. Uh, injuries is not, it's, it's part of the game, but it's, it's difficult if you get injured uh, just before the tournament of inner tournament. Yeah, uh, I think for me in my career is just to stay healthy at this moment. And there's a lot of rugby that's going to play this year, but uh, for me it's just being healthy every tournament and, and be injury free uh, over the weekend. Darren Adonis, who is a relatively newcomer to the Blitzbox squad for the Sevens World Series, is keen to cement his position in the team. He will be playing in his fourth tournament this weekend. After found, finding my rhythm and getting into the, the habit of the game, it's quite difficult to switch off and switch on again and make the, the cut again. I think it's a long year. Um, it's quite a bit, bit of rugby for this year after the COVID and all that. And after all it's World Cup, so I think the preparation and the build up to the World Cup will be nice to have uh, game time playing and have a good prep until then. Mb Fisher will again lead the South Africans this weekend because captain Sivue Soizwapi was injured in the first match of the Malacca tournament last week. Mtutuzi Ndlovu for SAPC News.